the other uh, fun things about Dunces is because it's such an episodic piece, because there's so many scenes, there's so many transitions. We're able to not only use original music, but also look at source music from the era itself. Sometimes it's coming at you live from the two musicians. Other times it's a recording of a tune. Sometimes it's a, uh, a combination of live and recorded together. And I think marrying both those worlds is part of what makes the, the ultimate uh, combination of music and the show dynamic, exciting, just a lot of fun. And everything is pretty much leaning towards what's happening in the scene. So if there's a riot breaking out, then the music will be like crazy. People are running around and stuff like that. And uh, if it's a calm scene or something, sometimes the music will be more calm. So then it's also interesting to see how the actors have to react to what we play in between the scenes. I think the music is important. It gives it the New Orleans live feel, the spontaneous feel, because New Orleans is very spontaneous. And, uh, there's a lot of improv improvisation in New Orleans, not in just the music, but just in life. It's in the blood of everyday life. And it's not uncommon for there to be what we would think of as a battle for sonic supremacy going on between the group that's playing on the corner and the group that's playing on the next corner and the group that's playing around the corner. It's just a city that runs on an engine of music. So being able to access the variety of styles of New Orleans music was one of the great challenges and delightful joys to give that sense of a tumbling musical environment like this.